Hey guys, Derpy here! And for the foreseeable future until Cat gets more merch! But we have some great merch today, guys! We have some brand new posters of Karina and my series! I might be a little biased, but I do like my poster! You guys don't even need to get them as posters! We have notebook versions so that you guys may write down your dirty little secrets into it! We will judge you. Anyway, enjoy the video, guys! The content within this video is not suitable for children. Viewer discretion is advised. So if this is all mine, I'm, I should be able to change it if I wanted to. Because I would really like more space for cooking and storing things. So, that's on my to-do list. I'm not sure how to exactly change it all on my own, but anything should be possible at this point, now that I have this place all to myself. But I, I think I've let Morse and Stella wander around for long enough. Where are they? Not here. Um, uh, I think I see Morse. Morse? What are you- Oh. Hello, Karina. Hi, what's going on? Enjoying the view? Nothing, I was just watching your friend fly off into the horizon or something. Why? Did- Did Stella, Stella do something? Or is she okay? Or What do you mean? Well, I don't know. She doesn't usually run off. Did she see anything before she did it? She said she was going to get another friend. And rode off to the stars above. Oh. Hmm. Well, she'll probably come back down. Probably. Or she freezes to death up there. Can you be nice? <sighs> right. I was only wandering around the place, then I watched that thing. It was a bit entertaining, to be quite honest, Karina. But... I'll be nice. I appreciate it. I know you're not a big fan of people with, or even souls, with a lot of energy, but I feel like Stella's a nice change of pace to purgatory. Definitely changes the atmosphere. Yeah. Well, this is my, uh, childhood home. Yes. Big place. Mm -hmm. I've never been to Morpheus's. Mm, do you want to say anything in particular? Suppose you could start with your room. Well, I guess your childhood room. Oh yeah, I've already taken a few things about back to uh, to take back home. I've already put my dolls on display. But have you now? Mm -hmm. But should be right up here. I haven't really touched it much, and, well, I didn't expect my father to ever touch it, but here it is. Mm -hmm. uh. What do you think? Well, it does scream you. It does? Reminds me of a time when you were a child. I think your bag at bed is bigger here than it was back in Purgatory. Oh, it was sizable for me as a kid. Even when it was in, even in Purgatory, the other one was pretty sizable for a little while. Mm. And then I had my growth spurt. Right. Right. Sorry, I just... I wonder what you were like before, then. Well, um... I can always tell you. Well, what do you want to know? Well, well, I'll be honest, Karina. I don't know if there's much else to tell. We've lived with each other for... quite a long time. Yeah, we have. I'll be honest, I wasn't much different. And a closet. Yeah, a closet. Um, 
not much in there. Still have some stuff in here, but... What's with the boots? I don't know. Why? <laughs> it's just... Well, sometimes Put them on as a kid. Well, I thought they were fine to play with. How would you play with boots? The characters in my books used to have big red boots, so... I wanted the big red boots, too. What character has big red boots like that? I can find the book if you want. If it's still here. Oh man, I don't even remember how I sorted all these back then. Well, you were a child. I doubt you did any sorting. Actually, I didn't have much to do back then. Morpheus didn't want me to bother him. And the servants, well, they're a bit odd. They were mostly there to just take care of Morpheus and make sure I was fed. They never talked to me and rarely played with me. So I hmm. didn't have much to do other than read and play games I made up and sort. Would it be that one? This one? Yeah, actually it is. The Wizard of Oz. I think they were ruby slippers, but... Well... I kind <laughs> of... would be close enough, I guess. To me, yes. Especially since my father would never give me those. And besides, <laughs> I used to draw her with big red boots anyway. <laughs> And you had a little seesaw horse. Mm hmm I kind of want to take it back to purgatory, but... I don't know. I don't know what, what I would do. What'd you do with it? Just have it as a display? Well, yeah. I used to play on this all the time. Besides, I think Thanatos would like it. The cowboy movies. Maybe. Hmm. What else is there in this house, though? Um... Honestly, a lot of guest rooms, and there's Morpheus's room, and there's also the servants' quarters. Where are you planning to sleep here? I don't know. I have to think about, I don't know, redoing everything. As much as I still care about this place, it holds a lot of painful memories for me. Does it now? I just remember how lonely I was. If Morpheus did anything right, it was letting me have a friend at the very least. And who was that be? Oh, come on. You don't have to get me all sappy or anything. Oh, I'm just wondering now. Who would that be, Karina? You. You know, you were kind of oblivious at times. Oblivious? Mm-hmm. Should we go check and see if... Stop. Do you want to go first? I would insist that I do. Okay, go ahead. Who are you? I'm Asteria. Asteria? Karina? Or Asteria. You're different than what I imagined. And you're more beautiful than I could have ever hoped. I... <laughs> oh, jeez. Mars, would you mind if I had some privacy? Of course, just... Of course. Apologies. Mother, you're really here? Of course I am, baby. I'm right here, Karina, my sweet angel. Is it okay if I hug you, or is that a little too forward? Of course, Karina. I've been waiting for this moment your whole life. You're really here? Is this a dream or anything? 
This isn't a dream, my little starlight. I'm right here. I have so many questions. I, I don't want to bombard you with them, but... Would you mind? Ask away, Starshine. Well, y you didn't really go fully into detail about, about it before, but... And you don't have to if you don't want to, it's just... Well, why did you leave originally? Don't want to bore you with details, but... We'll say that there's some things that even love and being a god can't overcome. Can't be around for very long. Unfortunately, literally being the stars means that I can't be around for long periods of time. I see. That, that explains a lot. But you really wanted to stick around for a long time. I imagine. More than anything. So, why, why did you and... Why was I made if Morpheus didn't even want me? I wanted you. Morpheus. He... <clears throat> I, I cannot begin to express the anger that I feel towards how he treated you because of his grief. But we both wanted you. We had planned a life together, a family together. But because of his grief, he couldn't even stay by your side like he promised. I mean, the way he talked about you and the pain in his eyes whenever... I, I, I'm not angry at him anymore, just sad for him. And for you. Our parting was hard on me as well, but it showed me what kind of a god he truly was. Well, how come you guys can't, I don't know, still see each other? It's not that simple. It's better that we never see each other again. That way we can both heal and we never learn to throw away our duties like that ever again. I see. I guess it is a lot more difficult to be a god than I originally thought. That's enough about me, Starlight. I have to know all about you. God, I've waited for so many years just to be able to see your face. Tell me about yourself. I want to know everything. There's no stars in purgatory. I've missed so much of you growing up. You would look over me through the stars? Any chance that I had. So, when Morpheus took me to purgatory, you never, you didn't get to see me grow up like you wanted to. Wait. It's all I could ever think about. Well, then I'll tell you about it. Um, well, where should I begin? Um, well, you know about everything that happened here before Purgatory. How about I tell you about everything that happened afterwards? I'd love... Oh, Starlight, I'd love that very much. And you won't leave right away, will you? I'll stay for as long as I am physically able. Okay. Um, should I get you something to uh, uh, to sit on, or maybe I can get something? I, I don't know. Um, I mean, th there is a, a big chair over there. Um, uh, that 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 might work. And then we can sit. For myself, darling. You go ahead and just start telling me all about your life. Okay. Um. So it all started. Um. When I was when I, when I was brought to Purgatory, I had never been there before, so it was kind of scary.